if you're looking for a subscription to well subscribe stay tuned because we'll be unboxing one today hello everyone my name is laura v and welcome welcome back to my channel today's video we are going to be unboxing my color curate subscription box for the month of august and i'm very excited about it because i'm always excited about my color curate subscription boxes to be honest but first don't forget to click the subscribe and the like button because that would mean a lot to me let's just get it started shall we i'm going to move you guys a little bit closer so we see together what i got this month all right so here we go let's open oh nice it reminds me of the water the ocean kind of thing watercolor right so cute let's open up for the first item da -da -da -da. what do we have here it's a berry gel by Trifo Cosmetics Lip and Face Gloss. And face gloss? Oh, I'm interested. And I have the strawberry one. So let's see. Oh my gosh. Look at this packaging. So cute. Oh my gosh. what's this next one we have again another trifo cosmetics item and it's summer souffle it's face and body bronzing primer interesting and i have the caramel glow <laughs> oh my god i absolutely love the trifo cosmetics packaging they are always this cute it's it's adorable um, though I can barely see this, I need glasses on a good day, but this is a lot. Wow. This is cool. Third item. This is a So Susan Cosmetics. It's Social Butterfly because they thought it was parrots before. But what is it? Doesn't say. Oh, we have some sweats. Well, it has been quite hot anyway, so I don't blame me. Oh my God, this is so soft. Fourth and last item, it's a palette as expected snug in there it's a jelly pom pom cosmetics original sheen intense eyeshadow palette and i have the intense summer oh nice they have names okay usually they don't name their shades that's nice Nice! I like the purple color. Not so much for summer, but it's it's good for every day. I've been seeing a theme with um, Color Curate. They've been sending a lot of like everyday products that you can use on your everyday life rather than just, you know, like dramatic makeup. So this, this is good, this is cool. Let's come back to the other angle so we can actually put this to use. All right, it's obvious that we have to do kind of like natural bronze smoky look because we have the bronzing, we have the palette. It's not colorful at all all of them are shimmery i don't know what to do to be honest maybe i'll do something with the beach club and the one sec maybe something with the refill too let's do the hard candy glamouflage 
<laughs> full coverage foundation. I have the color linen over here and we are going to use that. For the concealer, I will use my Morphe Future Perfect on the shade medium tan. Actually, let's add to that the e.l.f. green crayon that they have just to do something with this redness that I have on my face going on. Um, you know, just to help a little bit. The hard candy foundation is like, it reminds me of concealer and it helps when you're trying to do like a very simple look if you want just a little bit of foundation this kind of applicator is perfect i'm gonna just do one layer of foundation i bought this foundation during winter so yeah so I balance it with a darker concealer. Not bad. Now we'll do this guy over here, the Face and Body Bronzing Primer. Look at that. It's a perfect square. <laughs> so silly. This side looks good. This side, oh my gosh, what did I do? <laughs> it smells like something. It always smells like something. I, I should have known. Kumquat and avocado. I think I smell the kumquat. <laughs> I didn't have to use a lot. I still have um, product left. So if it was like a regular day, I would use it on my, on my eyelids for sure. But we have the palette, so we are not gonna skip that. I have here my e.l.f. putty blush on the shade Turks and Kaikos. This blush is amazing. Like all the hype you see about this is true because I love this thing. With quite of a fluffy brush, I am going to go on the shade Oh wow, oh my gosh, look at the shimmer. Let's tap on some of the refill right here. They describe this as a smoldering brick. It has more gold into it. The one sack, this one right here. So I'm gonna get a smaller brush. I'm gonna smoke until the middle of my bottom lash. It needs like a good liner by me, by my beauty brand. Uh, the shade is Black Liquid Eyeliner. I think over here is a good line. For the waterline, I'm using my Love by Betsy, the brown pencil. Quick question, go to the comments. Um, do you also open your mouth when you're doing your makeup? I think it, it helps focus. <laughs> All right, let's use some Well People Mascara. I really like this mascara because it's not clumpy. Okay, the moment I've been waiting for, lipstick. We will actually use all four of the items that they send. Usually I, I ignore one or two. Actually, just one. I usually just ignore one. At first, I did think that this was red. The formula of these lipsticks is just amazing. Oh, answering my earlier question, it's on the top of the lid. It's So Susan Lipo Pout. So, there you go. It feels so nice on the lips. Like, it's very buttery, so it's really nice. But now, I really want to apply the little gloss from Trifle Cosmetics, and I'll get it all over here, but oh well. This is the only thing that I don't like about applying lip gloss like this. It's because, like, now what do I do with this? This is so cute! It smells like that is strawberry that is not really strawberry kind of thing. It does feel a little runny, but 
maybe it's because I didn't really let the lipstick settle before I applied the, the lip gloss. So I'll give the benefit of the doubt, but here I am. Okay, 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 okay. So favorite item of the box, I think that title this month it's going to go to the gloss because this this is adorable look at look at the size of this oh my gosh this is adorable this is making my lipstick run into my my teeth but i don't care it's my favorite item of the box for sure so maybe i'm not gonna mix these two together next time but I will definitely use the gloss by itself because it's just, I love it. The scent is adorable. The packaging is adorable. Adorable. <laughs> if you haven't done it yet, please click the subscribe and the like button because it would mean a lot to me. I do these unboxings every month. So I will leave on the description down below the link for my playlist on all the unboxings that I did for Color Curate so far. I'm gonna go and take some cute pictures and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye!